The year is 2083 and the Earth lies in chaos. Drastic changes in the climate have caused global temperatures to rise to unprecedented levels. The Arctic regions have melted, sea levels have risen, and the climate has been irreversibly altered. The world's population has been diminished to several million people. Human civilization is on the verge of extinction. Could all of this have been prevented? The answer is yes. Since 1975, a scientist by the name of Brecker suggested that greenhouse gases would heat the Earth's atmosphere. To get an idea of the mechanics behind this theory, watch Futurama's rendition of this crisis. Indeed, Brecker was correct. In the past century, global average air temperature near the Earth's surface has risen nearly an entire degree Celsius. Oil and coal production companies have hindered the progress of solutions for global warming. Coincidentally, Oil and coal are the leading sources of greenhouse gases. Fortunately, there is also a strong campaign to reverse the foul effects of global warming. You don't necessarily need to outfit your house with solar panels to make a change. For example, tuning your thermostat 2 degrees lower in winter would prevent roughly a thousand pounds of carbon dioxide from being released into the atmosphere, as well as save you $98. That's 10% of the average American's carbon output that you have eliminated right there. Now imagine if you were to bring your emission to nearly zero. Impossible, you might say. But many have done it. In fact, by installing solar panels as mentioned earlier, your meter will run backwards and feed energy back into the grid. As an added bonus, the power companies will hand you over some cash. But let's get back to the everyday. You can go to stopglobalwarming.org to find examples of how and what you can do every day. Here are some examples just to start you off. Remember, never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, it is the only thing that ever has. Go out. Make a change.